everyone. I hope you had fun learning how microbits work with Eric today. You had a chance to practice four coding skills through the microbit make code website. Uh, you'll be building on this knowledge in the next session as you use your coding skills and your knowledge of how circuits work in order to build your own soil moisture sensor. The soil moisture sensor you built is going to help us collect soil moisture data at Crystal Cove State Park. This will ha help us answer our third research question and test your hypothesis from session four. That way, we'll be able to show how water saver plants, water spender plants, and non-native plants are affecting the amount of moisture in the soil. But before we conclude today, let's again take some time to reflect on what we've done. What did you learn? Uh, did your thinking change? Move on to the next slide and take a few minutes to reflect and answer the questions in, the, in your field notebook. See you again soon!